Welcome back to World Rally Turkey on Dave. We've already seen a couple of our top drivers come a cropper here on these rough stages. Ken Block, broken steering arm, and just 100 metres down the road, Henning Solberg, same problem. One of the factors behind that is this is a brand new rally, and that means a brand new set of pace notes. But what is a pace note? Well, it's a note read by a co-driver to a driver to tell him what pace to go, pace note. We took one of Ken's notes from day one and spoke to him, obviously, before he went off, to find out how it all works. So first of all, can you explain to me what each of the individual symbols and letters and numbers mean? I, I don't know what the hell they mean. <laughs> <laughs> this would be 70, 70 meters. That would be a straightaway. It would be a right turn. Four minus is the severity of the corner. Four minus is, uh, you know, a fairly a quick, a yeah, fairly quick medium speed okay, corner. Right. DC means don't cut. It means that there's probably something on the inside of the corner that could either damage the car or cause us to flip. Right. Don't want to do that. Mm -hmm. And okay just means that the road surface I know is going to be fairly consistent all the way through the corner and I can drive very quickly. When you hear this, what does it make you do? That's a difficult thing that a lot of people don't understand. Not only are we hearing these notes, but we have to analyze what the car is going to do in every situation because it's a, it's a flowing piece of road that just because it's 70 right for it, it all determines what's before it and what's after it as far as what speed I can take it and how I can attack it. Why can't you just drive the stage as you see it? Well, I, um, I think without notes, you'd be about 30% slower. You'd have to be guessing over every corner. You have to be able to, to you know, have something that the co-drivers tell you and then trust it implicitly. And every driver has their own way of writing their note for this precise part of the stage. This is what Ken Block has for it, which is a 70, right four minus, don't cut, okay. Let's have a look at what you've got in your notes. See, already it looks very different. Uh, tell us what this says, first of all. A 100 fast right tight. Okay. Uh, so 100 is the distance? That's the distance, yeah. Then basically because my notes are describing, I don't use numeric notes than some drivers use. And that actually doesn't matter what you use as long as you understand it yourself. It doesn't matter if you have rabbits or horses in your notes. As long as it's always the same. But I'm describing. But you've got no don't cuts, nothing like that. I just go there and I see what's coming and then that's enough. If there's nothing really hiding there, I don't put it in the notes. It's, if I can see it, then for me that's enough. Explain what this says. For me, that means uh, 100 meter, and uh, that's uh, right, right. 130 minus, so that's uh, for me an angle. Uh, I use only angle in my, in my notes from 10 to 150. And then within that, you have minus what? Uh, yeah, I have minus, plus, 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 bon. It's uh, another one <laughs> okay. uh, that I put in the middle of everything to try to have as precise notes as, as possible. So, and that's all, you know, every single millisecond is made up with those degrees? We have to. <laughs> so, nowadays you have to, to be very precise in the notes because uh, you have only two passes in a race, so it's impossible to memorize the stages and so you need to, to have very precise notes. That's maybe the most important part of, of our job. And that's just one note. There can be 15 notes on a page, and that equates to almost 3,000 per rally. So, remember, that note. We'll be revisiting it later. But now let's rejoin Paul King for the rest of the action. Thanks, Neil. Well, the battle for fourth has really heated up this afternoon. Yanni Matti Latvala had a quiet morning. He has now upped Remember his note. Hmm? Well, this is the section of stage to which it refers. Obviously, these are Ken Block's notes. We won't be needing those again, but it gives you an idea. So that was the 70 meter straight or 100, depending on whose notes you read. Coming into this fast, medium fast right, or uh, as uh, Daniel Elena will say, droite 130 minutes. Um, so coming in, now interestingly, Ken Block had don't cut. Obviously, there's a massive concrete culvert on the inside of the corner, so if you do cut it too much, it's crunch, crash, splash. But um, the others don't have that because they can see that it's there. So the driver can process that information before he gets to this corner. The co-driver will deliver the note all the way back, back here. here. 
Now, this is the driver's eye view of our approach to our right-hander down there. There it is, that's our right-hander. Sebastian Loeb should be in the stage. Let's jump on board with him and co-driver Daniel Elena to see how they navigate our little section. Bon plonge. Sur gauche droite à fond. 150 mètres. Gauche 140 plus au surprême. Right, here is Seb's note and our corner in the distance. Let's listen to Daniel Elena deliver the note. Now Seb has to analyse that information, get the car into the right position and drive that corner, all the while, of course, taking on more notes and information for the road ahead. So now in Yarmo Leitinen's pace notes to Mikko Hilven and listen out for the whatever the finish is for the hundred and then the fast right tight. Now that's Seb's note with his angle method and this is how it converts to Mikko's descriptive method. Let's listen to Yarmo's delivery and watch Mikko drive our corner. Amazing, just showing you exactly why the pace note is crucial. He was set up for this fast right tight. Already back there, pointing straight at us, all the way around, set up, perfectly set up again for the exit, and there he disappears in a trail of dust.